Hello everyone, today we will be demoing our CS3110 final project, which is the OCaml MBA simulator. Our project is an interactive tool that allows users to create, manage, and compete with custom basketball teams. The simulator supports multiple gameplay modes, including regular season, playoff, and tournament simulation. It calculates game outcomes using sophisticated player and team rating algorithms that takes into account individual statistics and team dynamics. Users can customize and add new players through an intuitive player creation interface, which updates player attributes dynamically. The user interface runs on the command line with rich visuals of NBA season progression. When first loading up our game, you're first greeted with our home screen, which enables players to press P to play now or press H to learn more about supported features and how to play. So let's say you're a first time user, then you'd want to press H. And here you're at our help screen, which shows game features such as adding players, creating teams, previewing teams, and simulating a NBA regular season and playoff tournament. If you're ready, then you press P to play. You were then prompted if you would like to add a player. In this case, sure. We add a player, we'll call him John Smith. His position will be a point guard and we'll have the following attributes. These attributes will be added onto our complex player algorithm to add them to a team. If you would like to add more players, you're prompted now. Now we are prompted whether we'd like to get a preview of the team. In this case, let's select yes. Now this shows a current lineup of a randomized grouping of NBA players onto NBA teams. Here in this case, let's say we want to update a player staff. Let's say yes. Let's enter the team name, say in this case, the Magic, and enter the player's name to update. Let's do LaMelo Ball. We can add, now add a new shooting rating and other attributes to this new updated player. Now we've seen that player stats have been updated successfully. If we want to add more, we can do so, but in this case, let's not. Now, all we have to do is press enter to simulate the season. Now here we have a up-to-date and live updates of what the NBA season is looking like, including wins, losses, and overall statistics. Now after the season is complete, we can press enter to see the standings. And now we can see Hawks are at the bottom and we have Mavericks as the number one seed with 29 wins and 12 losses. Now let's enter the playoffs. Here we are prompted with the current playoff bracket in round one, in which the Mavericks are paired up with the Nuggets, all the way down to the 76ers against the Spurs. This is a round one, and then we can continue to round two, in which we see a less amount of teams. We could press enter again, we get to round three, and here we're at the finals in which it is the Wizards versus the Spurs. We press enter to continue to the final round. And now we see the Wizards have won the tournament according to our player algorithm and overall game simulation with this nice final ending screen. Thank you.